Hey everyone, John here. I want to do a quick video on the turbo on my Mall M5. It's actually one of the, it is the only M5 in the world that has a turbo, a normalizing turbo that is. So I uh, just kind of wanted to go over how I use it and uh, how it's all set up. So right here you have the air that comes in, runs down to the normalizing turbo right here. And normalizing turbo feeds the carburetor. And one cool thing about it is this plane doesn't need carb heat because the turbo, the air from the turbo keeps uh, the heat warm. Uh, another thing is it has a couple fuel pumps that feed the turbo down here when you turn it on. And I'll show you inside on how you turn it on. So right here you have the controls for the turbo. So if you are below 8,000 feet, you switch it down, it turns on one fuel pump. If you're above 8,000 feet, you flip it up and it turns on both. And then you basically just dial the turbo in right here to the manifold pressure that you want. Now, when I'm doing stole stuff, I'll, I'm usually down low, so I'll have it low, and I will dial the turbo in to uh, 28 inches of manifold pressure. It usually gives me another 50 RPMs or so. All right, so I wanted to post a video on how I use my normalizing tur turbo for stole. Um, usually, I'm at about 26 and a half inches of manifold pressure, and I can put it up safely to 28 inches. So what you'll see me do is I'll lean out the mixture, and then I will start dialing in the turbo till I get to 28 inches. Um, after I take off, I'll get the mixture in quick and turn the turbo off because it tends to get hot pretty quickly doing it. So um, that's what uh, you'll, you'll see me doing here. Hey everyone, thanks for checking this one out. Um, if you like it, hit that like button. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and uh, we'll see you on the next one.